stuff. I gotta throw more money out there. It's not about more money. It's not about more money. Follow me? It's about taking your advertising budget and being flexible. Check this out real quick. If you were thinking, how am I gonna pay for a display? This is a Nielsen and Yahoo mobile study. 86% of the folks are using the mobile internet while watching TV. Is that a surprise? Yes or no? It's not a surprise. How many people in this room have a tablet? Right. Happens every single day. That was about 86% of the room, by the way. <laughs> what do you do while you watch TV? The kids go to bed, grab your iPad, you grab your tablet, you go to town. Well, guess what people are doing while they're using the mobile internet? Browsing the internet, they're using social networking sites, primarily. If you're asking yourself, Matt, why do those percentages add up to more than 100? It's because the survey was one of those check all that apply. So you can do multiple things, right? But it struck me that, hey, wait a minute, this is where we live today. This is a lot of what this conference is about, is about people who are browsing the internet and social networking. So why not take some of that budget that we know people are either DVRing through, your TV budget, or we know that when that commercial comes on, they're going to their iPad, and move some of it, some of it, or a quarter maybe, into a display advertising campaign and reach out to them where they are uh, when they're distracted by that device. Okay. Uh, the real message here, uh, when we're talking about 2012 best practices, what I, what I like to talk about is this sweet spot. If you're a golfer, you know the sweet spot on your driver. You know when you hit it, it's unmistakable. In this case, I wanted to give you a bit of a, a, an illustration of where I think the sweet spot is. Okay, it's, it's right there, the combination of paid search, SEO, and display. Sometimes people say SEO is dead. You don't have to listen to any of that. SEO changes, SEO evolves, but SEO is still part of what we do every day. Right? Paid search and display are a no-brainer. We spent some time talking about those. So when you're thinking about how our dealership is doing, are we really hitting this sweet spot? Try to fit yourself in here and see if this works, if this really represents your strategy. So what do we do once we earn that visit? There's a lot on this slide. This is not a typical uh, Matt Murray slide, I would say. However, couldn't help but share some of these numbers. This is some of our internal user experience data, okay? And it's focused specifically on tools found on the website, okay? So if somebody 